One. Two. Two. Three. Three. Erling Haaland was born in Leeds in the year 2000 when his father was a player for Leeds United. Alf Inge Haaland had gone to England seven years before after moving up the ranks at his hometown club Breen. Alf Inge had to stop from football three years after Erling was born due to injury issues. He was famously hit by a nasty Roy Keane hit although he already had difficulties with his left knee that were irrelevant to the Manchester United strikers red car incident. Alf Inge chose to return to Norway with his family once his top-level profession ended. While Haaland senior left football to become a property developer back home, he supported his son to continue playing the sport he adored, with Erling following in his father's footsteps and joining junior program coach Alf Ingve Bernstein was instantly pleased by his club's hard-working new addition, who played in attack rather than defense or middle field. As Alf Ingve had previously done with Nottingham Forest, Leeds United and Manchester City. Helland made his international debut with Norway's under-15 team during the 2015-16 season, after impressing for Brine reserve side with 18 goals in 14 games. With the Norway setup, his route crossed with Gunnar Halle, his father's colleague at Leeds in the late 1990s. Halle appreciated what Helen had to offer in terms of attack, but feared that his gangly build would keep him from making it to the top. Geute Larsen was fired as Breen's manager in May 2016 and Bernstein was elevated to temporary leader. Having worked closely with him at the youth level, the temporary manager gave Haaland his first start despite the fact that he was only 15 years old. After starting Haaland on the side, Bernstein moved him to his favorite central position after a few games. Despite failing to score in his debut season at Breen, Haaland was granted a trial by Hoffenheim before joining Molt and playing under Norwegian icon Ole Gunnar Solsar. Bernstein was not amazed by the transfer because Haaland had caught the attention of lots of teams by playing senior football at the age of 15. Haaland was somewhere where he could rapidly break into the first team and secure a smooth career progression. Gute Larsen was fired as Breen's manager in May 2016 and Bernstein was elevated to caretaker leader. Having worked closely with him at the youth level, the temporary manager gave Helland his first start despite the fact that he was only 15 years old. After starting Haaland on the side, Bernstein moved him to the, his favorite central position after a few games, despite failing to score in his debut season at Breen. Haaland was granted a trial by Hoffenheim before joining Molt and playing under Norwegian icon Ole Gunnar Solskjaer. Haaland completed his first season in Molt with four goals in the league, but he improved that number the following season, scoring four goals against the league leader Bren. He ended the 2018 season with 12 goals in 25 elite Syrian games, caught the intention of even more clubs. Leeds made an offer for the 18-year-old attacker, but he was attracted by the Red Bull Salzburg idea and went to the Austrian Bundesliga club in January 2019. Salzburg had been keeping close eye on him for years. Sporting director Christopher Freund claimed that they had observed him closely several times in order to understand more about the striker. He gradually incorporated into the Salzburg group, where Mons Dabur was the standout striker in the 2018-19 season. The Israel's remarkable return of 37 goals in 48 games made him untouchable, but it also drew interest from Sevilla in the summer of 2019. The quick start in Salzburg did not go unnoticed back home and Haaland was called into the Norway's senior team making his debut in September 2019. A couple of weeks later he made his Champions League debut and, and with it more history. After scoring a hat-trick against Genk, 
Holland scored with the next four group games to become the first teenager and just the fifth player in Champions League history to do so. Trips away from Salzburg not only increased his worldwide visibility but also provided him with additional time for personal and professional growth. Maximilian Wuber, a Red Bulls player, recalls Holland studying instead than playing games. If the finest teams in Europe couldn't stop Holland, neither could the Austrian teams. The 19-year-old had scored 28 goals in 22 appearances for the Red Bulls in all competition by the time the club's winter break arrived, including five hat-tricks. As a result, keeping him at Salzburg would be impossible, with Manchester United, Leipzig and Borussia Dortmund all keen. After meeting with the player, his father and agent Mino, Borussia Dortmund activated his 20 million release clause, beating United and Leipzig to his signature. Dortmund provided the striker with the best opportunity of consistent playing time by promising to make him the first choice striker, something Alfinger Haaland believes is crucial to his development. Haaland is constantly seeking for ways to enhance his entire game. He has already achieved success at every level at which he has played, scoring hat-tricks for pleasure in the last year. He even faced the most difficult test of his career when Borussia Dortmund played with PSG in the Champions League knockout stage. So tell me in the comments down below what you think about Haaland and his game and while you are there consider to like and subscribing to the channel, it helps a lot for better content. See you in the next one.